I am Dr. Manish Singhal and we are going to discuss stages of lung cancer and their respective treatments today. Lung cancer as any other cancer or most of the other cancers has got four stages. So lung cancer stage one is a cancer in which the cancer is located as a small nodule or a small lesion in the lung which is usually less than 3 cm and this type of cancer has not traveled to the lymph nodes in the mediastinum. When we say mediastinum we refer to the central uh, lymph nodes which is near the windpipe. This is called as mediastinal. So the usual treatment of stage 1 lung cancer is surgery. Usually we will cut that part of the lung and after that sometimes we give chemotherapy to these patients. Now coming to stage 2 lung cancer. Stage 2 lung cancer is a cancer where the cancer is located in the lung and it is more than 3 cm but less than 5 cm or even if it is less than 3 cm it has moved into the lymph node near the mediastinum that is where the windpipe is. So that is called as stage 2 lung cancer. Even stage 2 lung cancer the treatment is again surgery and usually in all the patients after surgery you will require chemotherapy. Usually no specific radiation is given in stage 2 lung cancer. Stage 3 lung cancer is a cancer where either the size of the lung tumor has increased to more than 5 cm to up to 7 to 8 cm or it has moved into the lymph nodes in the mediastinum. That means the number of nodes in the windpipe or around the windpipe have increased and have become very bulky. Usually these patients are not treated with surgery. They are generally treated with a combination of chemotherapy and radiation therapy. Uh, because after the chemotherapy and radiation therapy is over, usually what you do is you put these patients on immunotherapy which is the new, new thing which has come up. This has led to median survivals uh, of, uh, of around 4 years or so. So generally patients with stage 3 lung cancer have an opportunity to have a median survival of around 4 years. Of course there are around 30-35% patients who can get cured and never relapse back. The cure rates in stage 1 lung cancer is about 60%, the cure rate in stage 2 lung cancer is about 30-40% to 40 and the cure rates in stage 3 lung cancer is about 30%. In stage 4 lung cancer is a cancer which has moved to other parts of the body from lung. That is it has gone to bones, it has gone to either liver or the brain or a small gland over the kidney called as adrenal gland. These are the common sites where these cancer cells can travel. The treatment of stage 4 lung cancer depends on what type of lung cancer is there and what type of uh, mutations the lung cancer has. So usually lung cancer is divided into squamous cell and adenocarcinoma. And within adenocarcinoma now we have got nine different type of mutations and all these different type of mutations can be given different types of targeted therapies. For example, the most common mutation which is found in lung cancer is EGFR mutation in which you can give either jefferitinib, osimertinib or erlotinib. Whereas in ALK mutated lung cancer you have to give either crizotinib, seritinib or electinib. There is a new drug called as lorlatinib also which is third generation drug. In ROS1 positive lung cancer, you got to give either entrectinib or crizotinib. There are other mutations which have been detected in lung cancer now, such as BRAF mutation, where you can give vimurafenib and, uh, and dabrafenib and trematinib combination. HERT mutations can be given pyrotinib. There is another mutation called as MET mutation, wherein a drug called as carpmatinib can be given. All these targeted therapies are tablet form therapies and they perform much better than uh, chemotherapies. In case no mutation is detected, then you have to give chemotherapy. 
The new thing that has happened in stage 4 lung cancer is immunotherapy. So if somebody has got a PD-L1 positivity, which is a marker to decide whether immunotherapy will work or not, if that is positive, then you can give immunotherapy. The survival of stage 4 lung cancer used to be around less than a year, many years back. But today, the survival of stage 4 lung cancer is reaching almost 4 to 5 years. In many of these cancers, patients can live up to many years. And some of these patients can even get perhaps cured. If not cured, they will have long-term disease control. The 5-year survival rate used to be 0% in stage 4 lung cancer. And today, it is around 20 to 25%. So with this, I hope that this is information is useful for you and I'm open to receive any questions. You can post your questions and no more.